Hey there, join me as we look at the films that we loved from 1921 through 1929. Let's get started. In 1921, The Kid was featured as a comedy, drama, and family film. The tramp cares for an abandoned child, but events put their relationship in jeopardy. The Kid. It was a really good movie. You should check it out. Next up we have The Sea Lion, released in 1921, adventure, drama, and romance. When his long-suffering wife leaves him, the hard-driving captain of a whaling ship, goes through turmoils of life. This is the sea lion. Next up we have the infamous first scary movie of all time, Nosferatu, released in 1922. Vampire Count Orlock expresses interest in the new uh, real estate agent Hunter. Check out Nosferatu. Next up we have Little Annie Rooney, 1925, Mary Pickford as Little Annie Rooney. This is a drama comedy, and Annie Rooney is a tough young ragamuffin. Nice comedy, tugs at your heartstrings. Next up we have The Phantom of the Opera, released in 1925, one of the first horror films of that year. A mad disfigured composer seeks love with a lovely young opera singer. That is The Phantom of the Opera. Next up we have Sally of the Sawdust, released in 1925. Judge Foster throws his daughter out because she married a circus man. This is a comedy. So think back to 1925, over 100 years ago. Check out Sally of the Sawdust. Next up we have The Lost World, released in 1925, the first film adaptation of Sir Arthur Conan Doyle's classic novel about a land where prehistoric creatures still roam. The Lost World. The Lost World, rather. Next up we have A Lady of Chance, released in 1928. Seasoned grifter Dolly Crandall returns to the Badger game but has a change of heart when she falls in love with a young man she believes is a rich southerner. That is, a lady of chance. Next up we have Four Sons, released in 1928. A family saga in which three sons of a Bavarian widow go to war for Germany and the fourth goes to America, Germany's eventual opponent. This is The Four Sons. It is a drama war movie. Next up we have The Last Command, released in 1928. A former Imperial Russian general and cousin of the Tsar ends up in Hollywood as an extra in a movie directed by a former revolutionary. The Last Command. Next up we have Steamboat Bill Jr., released in 1928. It's an action, comedy, drama, family, and romance film from 1928. The effete son of a cantankerous riverboat captain comes to join his father's crew. Next up we have Street Angel. A woman on the run from the law finds her past catching up to her just as she is on the verge of true happiness. This is a drama. Street Angel featuring Janet Gaynor. Next up we have The Circus. Charlie Chaplin. Great legendary film released in 1928. The Tramp finds work and the girl of his dreams at a circus. This is The Circus. Featuring Charlie Chaplin. Next up we have George Bancroft in The Docks of New York. A blue collar worker on New York's depressed waterfront finds his life changed after he saves a woman attempting suicide. George Bancroft in The Docks of New York. Next up we have The Man Who Laughs. This is with 
uh, who is this with? I can't remember. Victor Hugo, I believe. When a proud noble refuses to kiss the hand of a despotic King James in the 60s, 1690s rather, he is cruelly executed and his son surgically disfigured. Next we have Applause, a drama musical romance movie released in 1929. A burlesque star seeks to keep her covenant-raised daughter away from her low-down life and abusive lover, stage manager. Next up we have Diary of a Lost Girl, also released in 1929. After falling pregnant to a pharmacist and refusing to marry, a young woman is thrown from her home and sent to a strict girls reform school. That is Diary of a Lost Girl. Next up we have The Iron Mask, released in 1929. This is an adventure, drama, history, and romance movie starring the legendary Douglas Fairbanks. Check out The Iron Mask. Next up we have is Pandora's Box. 1929 is a crime, dram crime drama and romance film. The rise and inevitable fall of an immoral but naive young woman whose insouciant eroticism inspires lust and violence in those around her. Next up we have the Marx Brothers in The Coconuts, also released in 1929. Chico, Harpo, Marco, and Zeppo, adventure comedy musical romance film. Check out the Marx Brothers. They were the king of comedy back then. Next up we have The Lost Zeppelin. No, not Led Zeppelin, but The Lost Zeppelin. This was also released in 1929. It's an adventure film. And Frozen Wasteland of Terror and Death. One of the more action movies of 1929. And lastly we have The Phantom in the House. This is a crime, drama, mystery, romance, and thriller. Back in 1929. A man is blamed for a murder that was actually committed by his wife. These are the films that were released that we loved between 1921 and 1929. I'm Tony, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.